Hello, Team Shazam. Hey, I wanted to um, go over just some quick tips on how to use PickMonkey.com. Um, so here it is, is www.PickMonkey.com. Um, and the way I use this is I make small little um, items. And so I just want to show you what I do is I actually use this design right here. And then you see that it says choose a canvas for your design. Um, so let's do a square. And now it, it does this little pop up and there's a whole bunch of different choices over here, but I just want to show you just some really quick tips um, on how you can do this. If you want to add an overlay, you're going to go over here and then there's a bunch of different options that you can do and to choose. But if you wanted to add your own, you just go to your own and then you can um, use browse your files to um, to download some some photos. And so let's let's do this one. Put it right there and you see that it will pop up right there on your screen and so you can make it as big as you want like that you can even maybe add some hearts on there and then if you want to go to words you just go to the tt over to the side then it will show you a bunch of different uh, blocks that you can choose. Um, the one with the crown is a royal feature. You pay for that. I think it's like $3 a month for that particular service. I use the free for quite some time, um, but I most recently um, upgraded and I really liked it, but you don't actually have to upgrade for quite some time unless you're just wanting those additional features and so it'll just let you kind of play with that and you can make it bigger if you want to just kind of play with those like editing tools right there and then when you're ready to save it you just go over here to, to save you've named the file pick monkey and save to your computer and let's just put it here and you're good so